subscribe, click the bell, and turn on all notifications. The one-stop destination for all WWE and AEW. Sean's View Entertainment. And welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube's history. This is the Dynamic Sean's View Entertainment, where we give you multiple videos a day around the clock. I never stop for each and every one of you, whether you agree, disagree, for me, or against me. I am here for each and every one of you. We got breaking news on Roman Reigns, the WWE title situation, the future of that title, the Royal Rumble main event now. Is it hanging in the balance? Is it now having to be canceled? What about the walkout? We're going to get into all the rumors, all the speculation, all the details. Right here on Sean's View Entertainment, we always make you feel some sort of way. Now, before we get into the main event of the video, ladies and gentlemen, the first teams have been announced for the breaking news 2024 WWE NXT Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic. Ladies and gentlemen, WWE has announced the participants as Braun Breaker and Baron Corbin, Nathan Frazier and Exeem, and the men's Dusty Rhodes Classic. Breaker and Corbin proposed their team on last week's episode, and it looks like they could have some fun together. Both teams are scheduled to compete on the upcoming January, during January 9th episode of NXT. Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers, this week's NXT marks the official announcement of the tournament. So, ladies and gentlemen, both teams will be in action this week, and their opponents will be revealed tomorrow. Also, Matt Hardy labels Jeff Hardy's critics as pathetic after an apparent botch on AEW Rampage. Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers, according to the Forbidden Door, and yes, we are going to get to the major report on Roman Reigns. Guys, a lot of rumors, a lot of speculation, a lot of details coming out from the rumor, rumor mill, because according to those, you know, as you can see, I'm ramped up, I'm amped up, so there's a lot of botches and bloopers during this episode, but again, show and viewtainment is authentic. We don't rewind, we don't record, we don't stop, we just keep going full bar ahead. This is what we call real-time viewers. One source reportedly suggested that the WWE and AJPW deal is adopting a cautious wait-and-see strategy, so there is optimism and highlighting WWE's more open stance under Nick Khan's leadership. Regarding rumors of WWE's interest in NJPW, we've heard that WWE has long maintained interest and in at least some connection with NJPW. Now, we know that this has been going on for a long time. These talks, the open door, the forbidden door. Well, listen to this one. What about WWE and AEW? Ladies and gentlemen, is there ever going to be a partnership? Is there ever going to be something formed? Is there ever going to be traded, talent traded between WWE and AEW? Well, Ladies and gentlemen, a partnership between AEW and NJPW, we already know has went down, but said that the new faces at the helm of both WWE and NJPW, it's at least more likely than it has been in a long time. Sources within WWE we spoke to said that Vince McMahon was usually quick nixed any, di any discussions as such. He quickly Nick canceled it, did away with it. Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers. The Rock, we got breaking news as concerns WrestleMania 40, as concerns The Rock, the most electrifying man, as we all know, The Rock came back. Listen to this one, viewers, fans, and subscribers, remember to click that bell, turn on all notifications, this is the hottest location for all WWE. Ladies and gentlemen, there is an envisioning going on, according to those in the know. WrestleMania 40 as the ultimate stage for The Rock. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I wouldn't be surprised wholeheartedly according to industry insiders, but to some degree, yes, I think he's got to earn it. If he's going to wrestle for Roman Reigns, is The Rock going to be a fan favorite? He needs to do something, I think, other than just show up, even though he's got the stop power to show up. I was a little surprised that he's back in the hunt for a spot, so we'll see how it works out. Uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, getting back The Rock on TV and getting him pre-engaged in the storyline, and it seems like the Roman Reigns thing is a perfect place for him. It might not do Cody Rhodes fans a lot of favors because I still think some people are still a little miffed that Roman beat Cody at the last WrestleMania. So there's going to be another piece of the journey. There's going to be another stop-off, and winning the Elimination Chamber is one way to do it. But, man, you've got to get another match. So your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions on that. Also, ladies and gentlemen, Bianca Belair aims to make history at the 2024 Royal Rumble. But now, viewers, fans, and subscribers, the main event of the video, the main attraction of the video on the marquee, Roman Reigns, has he walked out now? We all know there was a rumor that went out that Roman Reigns wasn't too happy. He wasn't too excited that he had to defend his universal WWE title in not a triple threat match, but a fatal four-way match against three other top main event stars, that being AJ Styles, that being... L.A. Knight, and that being Randy Orton. And then there was a lot of rumors and speculation that Triple H had a little bit of a conundrum, had a little bit of a drama, had some backlash from Roman Reigns. Triple H and Roman Reigns supposedly, evidently, went at it, according to those in the know. And Roman Reigns, the rumor is, is that he walked out, but we don't know if things got, you know, 
better. We don't know if things got worse. We don't know if Roman Reigns came back, if there was a text, if there was a phone call. Is Roman Reigns still the champion? A lot of rumors and speculation that Roman Reigns was suspended. Roman Reigns didn't like his placement. He didn't like this match. He didn't agree with it. He wasn't too happy with it. Again, guys, we're leaving it as pure rumor and speculation. But either way, the bottom line is what is confirmed is that Roman Reigns was none too pleased. He was none too happy having to defend his title in a fatal four-way match at the Royal Rumble. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions, and what should happen, and what should be the next chapter of Roman Reigns. Subscribe for news and rumors every time, all the time, and in real time. More to come from the Brash One. Stay tuned.